Well, hello to all my wonderful YouTube fans. How are you doing today? Well, thank you so much for tuning in today's awesome vlog video. If you're curious on what I'm doing today, you've probably seen this uh, before here. Basically, this is my Blu-ray internal drive, but the problem is it does not fit my new laptop, but what I got in the middle today, but can you guess what is in this drown shipping box, basically? What did I order to make that work on my computer? Well, let's find out, and let's do a wonderful unboxing, should I say. Let's go! And let's see what it is, shall we? Let's have a fun day. Before we get into the unboxing, let's go ahead and take a look at the actual drive itself. Okay. Basically, this is an internal drive. It's DVD, CD, Blu-ray drive. It's from LG. It's a really good unit. This is a couple years old, from 2013. But this is the power and SATA ports. But that's what I'm going to use on my laptop. But we're going to need a big knife to unbox this big box here, should I say. Always cut away from yourself when you're doing unboxings. Yeah, I say, Chris, what the heck did you get? Is there more computer ports? Hmm. Well, we're going to find out what is in this box. Ready, tubes? What is it? Ah! Oh, it's what it is. Sweet. Let's go ahead and move that off to the side. But basically, this is a external drive bay. Not for hard drives but for something like this. I was hoping this would come in lush today, but it actually came in today. It's pretty freaking awesome. Let's see what it is. Chris, why do you need a Blu-ray drive if your laptop already has a DVD drive in? Well, this was a upgrade I did with my old HP computer, but sadly, this does not fit in my new one. It's a thin old drive. But basically what this is, let's go to the box where you can kind of see. USB. Pretty freaking awesome. That's the enclosure. Here's some information about it. Not too bad. On the box. And guess what? It has a two-year limited warranty. Awesome. Alright, we don't need any type of knife to crack it open or anything, but let's go ahead and open it up and see what we got. Ah, of course. You have to read your instructions before you start using it. That's freaking awesome. Okay, let's put that off to the side. Let's see what else is in here. Ah, USB 3 cable. Pretty awesome. Looks like we do get a couple of screws to hold the drive case in place or the octo drive. This is going to be one awesome external drive unit. Alright, let's get this bad boy open here. Alright, basically, not too bad. Pretty awesome, should I say. Alright, I'm going to go ahead and install this, and I want to see what it looks like. So awesome. I'm going to say, Chris, how does this all go the ghetto? Basically, you're going to need a screwdriver to take out the two uh, screws right here in the back. And it does come with four mounting screws, but I will screw those in off camera. 
But basically, what you have to do, you know, buy one of these external aluminum style cases from this company here. Basically, you take off the two screws, one now, one now, and basically you gently pull this apart. Don't break it. And it's a little tricky, but it does come off. It does basically pops right off. Now you can see, this is what the back of it looks like. Slide this out. Put that there. Slide your octal drive in. And make sure it has the exact same connector what your unit has. And basically, snap it into place. You have two screws there. And two screws over here to help to hold it into place. And basically, once you're done with all that, oh, that's going to look awesome. And of course, you put the stuff on the back. Alright, basically that's my external Blu-ray drive. Sweet. Alright, let's go ahead and put the screws in. Off camera, please. Basically got everything ready to go. I didn't hook it up to my Windows 10 laptop just yet, but basically what it is, is a external uh, Blu-ray drive. But you're gonna say, Chris, you could have bought one for your computer. Well, true, I could have, but why do I need to spend more money if I already had a drive laying around I'm not basically using? Okay, but yeah. It's pretty freaking awesome. Uh, let's uh, show you what I mean. But basically, using this bad boy for my HP laptop here. And basically, here's my Blu-ray drive. Freaking awesome. USB is not connected yet. But before I connect it to my laptop, let's go ahead and show you what I mean. I can order it on, but I don't need to. Okay, it's $84.99, temporary out of stock, but that's the thin drive right though. But why do I need to order more ports? I don't need to, okay? Like I said, I already have it. Let's go ahead and hook it up to my laptop. I hope it works. <gasps> Dibs, look at that. The lights lighten up. And guess what? It's... somehow I don't see it yet. But there she is. Freaking awesome. Blu-ray ROM F drive. Okay. Now I don't have Blu-ray right now. But I know it probably does work. But there she is. Freaking awesome. I'd have to test it later, but you might have to download some type of software for the Blu-ray to work on your computer. But there you go, I thought it was kind of interesting to show you the unit itself. If you guys are going over on your channel, please hit that subscribe button. Please leave a nice comment down below. Please like, please share. Peace out. We'll hopefully see you in the next vlog. Have fun with external Blue Age Eyes.